Hi, my name is Kevin Martin, and I'm here at Eastern Standard to talk to you a little bit about the importance of ice when it comes to drink making. Uh, a few things to remember about ice when you're making a cocktail. Um, the quality of the ice and the coldness of the ice. I know it's kind of funny to say the coldness of the ice because you think that ice is actually the same temperature. It's actually not. The longer the cubes sit out, the warmer the ice gets. The idea behind shaking a cocktail is to add water to a cocktail and to cool the cocktail. If you're using ice that is already starting to melt, you're going to add much more water to the cocktail before the cocktail can cool down to the proper temperature. Um, so idea, take ice directly out of the freezer into your shaker to shake your drink. And then if the drink is shaken and then is going to go over ice, I would recommend using fresh ice from the freezer as opposed to using the ice that you shook with. If you're talking about doing a rocks drink, if you're going to have a scotch on the rocks or a rum on the rocks, um, I recommend actually using a large cube for a little less surface area. Um, the more cubes you have in a glass, the more surface area there is and the faster the drink is going to overwaterize or become watery. Um, so if you can get your hands on a large cube of ice or make them at home or get a block of ice and chip a large chunk off, that would be the best option for a rocks drink. Crushed ice is great for making drinks. Uh, I would not recommend shaking with crushed ice. Um, that would really tend to melt very, very quickly. Crushed ice is great when you're building a drink in a glass. Maybe give it a quick dry shake, like if you're making a uh, mint julep. Muddle the mint with a little bit of sugar. Add your spirit. Give it a quick dry shake. Add your ice, holding the mint to the bottom. Also with crushed ice, something to remember is you never want to shake a cocktail and pour it over crushed ice. Um, that would create a very watery cocktail. If you were to shake a cocktail halfway and then pour it over crushed ice, that's acceptable. Um, over shaking a drink and then putting it over crushed ice is going to create a very watery drink. Um, sometimes ice is the easiest thing overlooked at a party. Keep in mind, the colder the ice, the better the drink. The better the water that went into the ice, the better the drink. Enjoy your cold cocktails. Cheers.